right? A Lewis structure for carbon oxysulfide. OCS, oxygen is six, carbon is four, sulfur is six. So the total is 16 valence electrons. So carbon is in the middle. Through trial and error, you should get this structure. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eight around oxygen, eight around carbon, eight around sulfur, and that is a valid Lewis structure. Part B. What is the molecular geometry according to VSEPR? So around the central atom, carbon, there are two bonds zero lone pairs. Therefore, the geometry is linear. And part C. Does carbon oxysulfide have a dipole moment? So let's look at the bonds. Carbon, oxygen. Oxygen is more electronegative. Carbon, sulfur. Uh, there's a sulfur is just a tiny bit more electronegative, so very tiny going that way. So if you look at the if you look at the molecule as a whole you have a strong polarity going towards the oxygen and a tiny bit of a, a dipole going towards sulfur so in if you t as a whole you have a a uh, dipole moment going towards oxygen. So, yes, OCS has a dipole moment towards oxygen because oxygen is electronegative.